Owens Murphy here, how is all getting on today? So today I have an unboxing video for you and I've been dying to get this done. This is for the Skaven Blight Scramblers Blood Bowl team. Try saying that fast five times, I'm not even going to attempt it. But I've been so excited to get this done. Uh, this has been on my desk for like at least a week. I've been so busy with college and stuff that I just, I just haven't had time and I wanted to save it for the video. I have looked at the sprues but I haven't taken anything off so um, I sort of do on the video we'll have a closer look at it and then maybe at the end I might just put one together and we'll see what it's like at the end. Um, as I said in the last eBay loop video I did have a hard time getting this. Uh, I went out of stock pretty quickly and I couldn't get it. And then when I got the email saying it was back in stock it was gone again. So then eventually the third time I got lucky. Um, it's a super, super nice kit. This is, like I'm going to get another box of these just for conversions because, like if you look at these guys, they're just basically the clan nation. That's what they are. They're the Skaven Assassin uh, clan. The only bad thing is there's no Rat Ogre in it. I wouldn't mind getting a Rat Ogre separately, but it's a pity they just couldn't put one in it. It would have been so much nicer. But anyway, let's switch down to the table view and see what's in this box. Okay, so another thing about this box is that it's incredibly cheap. This is only 25 euro. And, well, it's, that's not cheap, like, but to be honest with you, I was expecting this to be about 30 odd euro. You get 12 models in it. For 25 euro, I couldn't believe it. But anyway, um, let's have a look at what's inside. Let's have a look at um, this one. Let's have a look at the back of the box. So you get two blitzers, two gutter runners, two throwers, two linemen, two linemen, two linemen. Uh, and you get a couple of little bits here. So you get a Skaven team ball, a Skaven team turn and reroll counters, and double sided tokens uh, comes in two sprues if I remember right so. so first up you get your instructions right now I was surprised but these were snap fit um, are not snap fit but they're pretty much close so they're kind of just they're only like two or three pieces um, but we'll have a better look at that at the end of the video when I have one of them put together. Uh, you get your transfers. These are super cool. They're not just your normal transfers. You get the Blood Bowl logo. You get the Skaven signs on it, which these are awesome. You can put these on your normal models if you want either. That's what I plan on doing. You get uh, one so you know which player is which. You get your line, uh, linesman, drawer, blitzer, rat ogre, uh, gut runner. So there's loads to choose from in the bottom. You have them in white as well. So that's that's pretty nice. Uh, slot of bases. I'm pretty sure these are 28 millimeters. Let's have a look and see if it says on them. Uh, no, it doesn't say. Uh, but this one here I have next to it is 28. So it's pretty much yeah, I'm pretty sure it's 28 millimeter. Um, if not 32, but um, but the two sprues, two identical sprues. So. It's only kind of worth looking at one of them, and it's just full of awesome bits on this. Um, so let's let's have a look at this bottom part first. So let's hope the camera will stay in focus. Um, so let me try and figure out which ones are which. So this guy running, and he has the football on the tail. That's your thrower. He's really nice. That ball he's holding, and the, the, the way he's standing is really good. Let's get a little bit closer. There we go. Really nice pose on the models. The details are really good. Um, that's really cool. Um, then we have this guy here. Let's see who he is. That is the lineman. One of the linemen. Um, again, the way he's standing his pose. He's kind of standing and pointing or something. Well, kind of pointing. Uh, but full of detail. You can easily use these models for your Skaven army. Here you have the football with the flames on it, kind of warfire flames. Um, let's see whose weapon is that? The blitzer, that's the blitzer's claws. Um, you have a shoulder pad with an arm with some knuckle dusters. Who has the knuckle dusters? The another lineman has them. I think the linemen all have knuckle dusters. Um, here we have another body, which is probably another lineman. 
Um, I hate the, the helmets are pretty cool. All of them have helmets. The gutter runner and the troller don't have helmets. The rest of them do. Because uh, the gutter runner is like really fast, has like hardly any armor or strength. You just get the ball and he runs. And the troller is like literally exactly what he says. He's a troller. Um, here you have the blood ball football, which is really nice. I can't wait to get all these little bits off the sprue. And um, this is what they called uh, Skaven team turn and reroll counters. Uh, so that's it's like a basically just a big rat ogre hand holding a football or a lump of warp stone. You can cut that off and stick it on a rat ogre. <laughs> um, here you have the gutter runner head and the arm. So the pieces are like they're not like they used to be like were pretty basic where you have like the body, you stick the two arms, you stick the head on. Uh, the parts are all kind of intertwined with each other. Like here you have the head and the arm. Um, what's this guy? This is a good runner. Look at this cape. Look at this cape. This guy is just asking to get converted into a scaven assassin or just used as a normal good runner. It's so nice looking. Um, this is a blade. Here we have the sh I like. I really like the shoulder pads. They're really cool. Uh, again with the knuckle dusters. Here we have the coin. Or is that coin? What did I call it? Double sided scaven team token. But I'm going to call it a coin. And the other side you have scaven markings on it and everything so that's that's like a really nice little collector thing to have i'm surprised they don't give you nothing as a free gift i'm surprised they don't give that to you as a free gift for something uh, it's really nice uh you have another football some more shoulder pads and then the last bit up here which we have another linesman uh it's a couple of heads the heads are really nice the helmets are fine you know they're okay but the gutter on our heads are really nice they're all like covered over on cloth and mass and as they're running along um, yeah that's it for the sprue it might not seem like there's not a lot on it but the other one is identical so you're going to get um, your guys you're going to get your 12 players out of it um, so what I'm going to do now is let's have a look at the box I'm going to uh, of, of course I have to make the good runner I have to make the good runner first so I'm going to go off camera I'm going to make this guy and I'll be back to you in one second ok so I just finished painting or not painting Jesus Christ I'm not that quick I just finished making the gutter runner um, and he is awesome look at this guy he is the equivalent of Batman Skaven running through the night i'm happy that i didn't give him a ball in his hand because they know people are going to use these as gutter runners and as normal models um he's really nice looking um a few things is the tail can be really fragile so you want to be careful not to snap that off um it can be a bit you don't want to press down on him too hard because it's only balanced on one foot. But other than that, he's perfect. Um, yes, they are snap fit. Um, it's incredible the stuff they can do now with GW. Um, it fits in too snug. I can't even get it out, so I'm not even going to try. Um, but it's really good. Uh, the only thing that really doesn't work for this is the base. It's t I, I'd imagine... Maybe it says on the box what size the bases are um, let's have a look no it doesn't really say on the instruction booklet either but I'm pretty sure it's 32 mil I don't have anything with me to measure but I'm pretty sure uh, but it's a little bit too big I know it's going to be a standard size for blood ball that's fine but if I was putting this guy on the gaming table I'd want this base just a little bit smaller maybe it's just this guy is a little bit bigger uh, let me see let me see if I can get a normal clan right here next to him where's that guy at here he is so this is a normal clan rat. This is your gutter runner. He's definitely longer. It's just a pose maybe. Um, but other than that, I absolutely love this guy. And I can't believe you get two of them. I really can't wait to get these painted up. He's so cool. This guy is such a badass assassin. Oh, no, I mean blitzball player. <laughs> um, you do get little slots in the base here to put the ball in. I think that's what it's for. Um, so yeah that's it for this unboxing and you got to see one of the guys met up at the end 
Um, but I love this box. It's so cool. The instructions, I forgot to add this in. Um, it doesn't even, not that it only shows you to put them together, but you get the rules for your skim blade scramblers. Um, you get your, their movement, their strength, their agility, their armor value, how much they cost in gold for the game. That's how it is in this instead of points. Uh, the skills they have. Uh, it doesn't give you the rules for the skills, but the weeping daggers it does. Uh, but I don't know which one has the weeping dagger. Linesman doesn't say, but it gives you the rules for it anyway. Um, that's pretty. That's a really nice little um addition into the box. So uh, definitely try and get yourselves a box of the Skin Blight Scramblers. If you guys have had a box of these or even the Blood Ball set, make sure to let me know in the comment section below what you guys think of it. Um, I can't wait to get my hands on that big box. The models look super awesome. Even the human team looks awesome. I really do like them. Uh, but with that, thanks for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Um, I just fell in love with a Skaven, another Skaven model. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching and I will see you guys in the next video.